Hi everyone. So things have been very crazy here. I just want to give you an update on what all is going on. We are getting the greenhouse fixed back up. Taking some time. But hopefully we'll be able to be planting in here for the fall crops throughout the winter. And then huh, throughout, you know, the rest of the years also. We have gotten the wheat fabric down and I'm going to put rock on top of this. I'm going to build shelves in the back. I'm going to put a line of boards down at the bottom there to help keep that weed fabric all the way at all the way at the bottom all the way through help keep that weed fabric in place we still have to put a another panel right there in that window it's blown out but we are working at it we've had this year has been super crazy. We have a senior graduate in high school. Our last one. Our last baby. Um, so that's been crazy. Uh, last Monday, when I was super excited about planting my plants, my tomatoes and my peppers, that we had a emergency happen that we never expected to happen, but always on guard that it will happen let me show you we have a gas line that runs through our property um last monday hi she must have laid an egg and wants to tell everybody last monday i was outside i had already Planted the tomatoes, planted the peppers, was super excited about that. Went ahead and power washed the house. And as I was doing that, got a phone call from a husband. Went inside, come back out, and just on top of that hill, over over a hill, about two, three miles from here the pipeline exploded and I had, I was the only one home it was quite a ways away from us it wasn't on our property so th very thankful also very thankful that whose property is on no houses nearby they nobody was hurt nobody is injured so but this whole year has been crazy so that's our update on the farm. Now, like I said, I planted the peppers and the tomatoes, but I took them back out because of the frost. They're gonna be, they're gonna have a little stunt probably to them, but they're protected from the frost. I had just today gifted some bok choy because it's doing really well and look it's getting ready to go go to seed so we really need to get that out and get that eight we have the celery and the cauliflower we have broccoli brussels sprouts and lettuce it's doing pretty good the all the potatoes they got a little bit a little bit of frost on them I even covered them up but the main thing is did the corn and beans now here's the beans and they did get a little frosted but not completely my purple beans I think they'll come out of it. Look at that. All the way down through there. They are A-OK. -okay. Now, the corn. The corn is the corn is a little bit disrupted. It's a, it got a little bit smashed. Black plastic was the way to go. And for the most part, 
the corn is okay. There are going to be bits and pieces that I will have to fill in in the corn where it would not come back. But still going to have some early, early corn. Look, look at this. I was so worried about the cucumbers. And they did get a little bit frosted on, but they have a new leaf. So I'm excited about that. Now, we did have a hard freeze. Like, it stayed at freezing levels for hours. So, with the experiment that I was doing, I think it fared pretty well. That's just the way it goes. Now, look at here. We have the blueberries in bloom. Aren't they gorgeous? Dogs are yappy. Let me go put them in the house and I'll continue the video. Everybody's happy to see me. I was... So the blueberries fared very well. The strawberries fared just fine in the frost. So for Mother's Day, I got an apple, a peach, and a pear tree, and another flower, and a rose bush. What's Katrina doing? There's our senior. What's she doing? What's she doing? In the tailgate. In the tailgate. Say hi, dude. That's so pretty. You did a great job. Alright, I'll leave you to it. Love ya. Love. Oh my, I'm so mad right now. This is not supposed to be on here. It's supposed to be up there so I can plant my melons in it. Them chickens. Them chickens are rotten. Hey, it's you. What are you doing? Crazy chicken. So, show you the, oh the baby, <laughs> oh goodness, and the other chickens, they're there, but I really wanted to show you, like the last video I think, I introduced you to the geese that we just got, look how big these things are growing. Go big. I'm just in time to help protect some meat chickens. Hopefully they won't be too big by the time they get here. Because they're big guys. They're almost the size of my small chickens there. They are nice, nice geese. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh yeah, you want pet? There you go. There you go. There you go, you happy now? Spoiled. So let's update on the farm. Been awfully busy and just too much going on along with everything else so i hope y'all had a good day i hope y'all had a great mother's day and i hope y'all come back